Give you guys another question. Give you guys advice on that life. Culture's slice. With that home slice. With that homie slice. I'm making myself look. That's how you are truly happy. And I'm trying to show the guys out there that, like, if you want to get a hot girl, like, just be yourself. <laughs> Stop playing. Okay, today's just question. Not. Today's question was: Is when was the first time you got a whiff of each other's body odor? Yeah. I never smoked. He does. I never smoke. You do too. No, I don't. Bro, if you guys want to get serious, Julia has the worst smell in her face. Oh Ever. That's I'm talking disgusting. about disgusting. Like, she does she can't put enough deodorant. <laughs> I had never smelled anything so crazy than Justin's like day old laundry from the Yeah, gym. laundry. Ugh. But when I'm actually working out I smell as clean as a butterfly. Oh you just spit on me. Speaking of spit. All I know is when I wash her clothes sometimes, her armpit stains are brown. They're like, <laughs> I'm being serious. I don't know, how do you even get that? I've never had that. I I've mean, I, now, don't get me wrong, I have doo doo stains. <laughs> I was a king of doo doo stains when I was a kid. But when you first met me, did you notice that I smelled different? No. I'm not gonna make some grandiose story like Julia, like, oh, first time I met you, you smell. Okay, first of all, if that's a true story, First time you met me, you smell, okay, first of all, I don't think we've been dating if I smell, if I smell that bad, okay? Because I even know if Julia smelled bad, I wouldn't have to hit her up. Thank you, but I'm glad I was so like, you can go ahead and tell that story, but we all know, we're all humans. Julia didn't smell anything different, she just smelled like the average, like, cultures collide right now, the average white girl. Like, good deodorant, not good deodorant, but good detergent and washes her clothes. Like that's what average white people smell like. I feel like all white people like smell sunny. And that's not a bad thing. They smell good. It's just like they smell like they, I don't think all white people smell good. I didn't say they I didn't say they smell good. I'm just saying they they all smell like they just got done with the laundry. Uh, I think it all depends. I don't really use I used to use a lot of products in my hair. Now I don't. And now I just don't care and I just wash my hair with like hand soap and I hear that's really bad. We're trying to overcome that. Because, well now I use head and shoulders because I used to have dandruff. They used to make fun of me because of that. But if you guys want to build a strong relationship, you have to go in deep in her armpits. You have to smell it. You have to smell every article of like, even when like, I know when Julia hasn't changed her socks, like that one time, what was it, last week? <laughs> she was convinced that she changed her socks. So but so are you. My, I've got better at that, because I remember my parents used to make fun of me, so I, I often, often take my time. But my gym shoes, they stink all the time. Those black ones need to go. If you guys like this, if you guys like the Topic Tuesdays, check out the other ones. Hit the subscribe button. Tell us your stinky stories in the comments below. And also, if you have any questions for us, uh, please let us know. Yeah, we answer them. I think every question on Topic Tuesdays, it's been a, it's been a fan question. So Even if you guys want to talk about like real stuff like uh, how to get a girl, <laughs> I'm a genius at that. How do you ask a girl to kiss you? Julia was a horrible kisser. I was a. Oh my I was, gosh. I was you the, need to I was, leave the room right now. I was now. the best kisser. No, just Julia sucks. wanted to anyways, train. Anyways, so make sure Julia's you like, share, and subscribe. Yeah. To go to subscribe.